Daddy's home again. Mark Wahlberg and Will Ferrell are back as the ex and the stepdad. Besides each other to contend with, their own fathers are in on it too. More daddies, more problems, more laughs. Hey guys, we got a big surprise. A trampoline? Another pony? Fake IDs? It's even better. This year, no more back and forth at Christmas. We're not doing the back and forth. Nope, I just said that. Yay! A together Christmas like a normal family! A together Christmas! I Hello? Grandpa Kurt? My dad is gonna scoff at everything we do. Your father hasn't met the new Evolve Dusty. I mean, who wouldn't be impressed with you? Bear. Oh, dear God. This is gonna come off weird, Dusty, but he's beautiful. Why don't you bring the car around? I'm not the driver, I'm Brad. Stepdad? My dad's coming too. Dad! That sweater, he wears a red sweater so I can see him in a crowd. There's my big man! Oh. <laughs> I just remember in the theater watching Mel dance. Anytime, I think I annoyed John a bit because I would always be imitating him, you know. But I mean, obviously, it was the it was the uh, form of flattery because I was just, you know, thoroughly enjoyed watching him. There was a point in the theater that. too where we're all kind of hugging and dancing, and there was uh, the Griffy, the little mm -hmm. little baby. Mm -hmm. We sometimes had a little stand-in for Griffy, mm -hmm. a doll, creepy doll, yeah. and at one point. I t it's not in the movie, but I took a to throwing Griffey into the air, <laughs> and all. Of course, we caught it, but that became we were. I had tears. So this code dad's thing. You gotta ask another man's permission to see your own kids. Everything is rock solid between me and Brad here. In fact, best friends. Really? <sighs> Brad, thank you. Stop it. I'm good. Cause we're boys. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get the whole girls thing. Here's the game plan. You wanna be that one that she tells you about all of her problems with the guys she's actually dating. It's called the friend zone. No, no, no. It's the worst advice anyone could give you. You wanna be like Brad and be in the friend zone? You wanna be like dad and get in the end zone? Oh, gosh. Those piercing eyes, like a velociraptor. The holiday setting is perfect. The um, aspirations of chasing the perfect Christmas is a great idea. And the subject matter mm -hmm. of sons and, and, and fathers and children and parents and uh, difficult situations in the home front, I think that that is prevalent and, and readily accessible in society today and will be in the future. I just think it's that's what's going to keep the movie pushing forward to stand the test of time. Daddy! Don't you want to spend the holidays with your one true, real dad? You brought him all the way up here just to get back at me? Yep. You're opening up the harbor, Brad. Oh, the harbor's wide open. Right. And it's Fleet Week. This is getting good, boys. We're gonna settle this physically. <laughs> Cut it out, this is child abuse. Don't be such a snowflake. Five more minutes and I get to meet Joseph. You throw that, we are no longer co-dads. <gasps> you gonna pump fake that thing all night? Are you gonna take a shot, Brad? Huh? He's never played sports ever. What? What? Maybe it's stuck to his hand. You know what, Dusty, you're not worth it. Psych! You're totally worth it! Yeah. Look for Mark Wahlberg and Will Ferrell in Daddy's Home 2 in your real-time theater.